quick review of my uh, Hammerhead Pre-Runner Bumper. Just purchased from BumpersOnly.com. Very, very happy with the uh, quality of the bumper. The finish is impeccable. The fit is absolutely perfect. Insulation was a breeze. Only con I had was uh, on the license plate here, there's no place to attach it. There, underneath that license plate, there is a cutout, a logo cutout. So what I did, I just put a, a couple extra holes in the license plate and used that cutout because I sure as heck wasn't going to drill a new a hole in my new bumper. Running 285s on here. I really don't think you should go bigger than that. You can run them stock. I did put a 2-inch uh, Top Guns custom level kit on this. I didn't need to. I ran it these same size tires stock for quite a while, but... Any bigger than that, you're going to start messing up a lot of stuff. And anything over two inches, you're going to, for a lift, you're going to mess up some stuff. So, two inches is plenty. I am going to put an add a leaf in the back to raise the back up a little bit. Right now, it's perfectly level, but I would like to get the back up just a little bit higher. Did put two inch spacers on the back. Those are from Bora. And uh, they brought the uh, width of the rear to be even with the front because originally the axle on this truck is about two inches narrower in the back bought this truck new in 1999 it is a 1999 ram 1500 paid 25,000 for it back in 1999 it's got 110,000 miles on it paint's still in great shape i clay bar it every year wax it at least every two months been in my garage so i got the original bumper on there it was chrome i sanded it painted it I have a lot of work I want to do that again I'm saving up I'm gonna get a new hammerhead bumper in the back to match the front whenever I can afford it put new Bilstein shocks on there 4600 and the ride is just incredible can't say enough good thing about those shocks I had ranchos on there they're gone in two years they basically just fell out this right here if you have a Dodge this is worn out stickers peeling off Go to Amazon, a company called Vivid makes it. It's just a vinyl wrap, gloss black. It takes about five minutes to put on. Dash skins for a new dash. If you have a Dodge, your dash is all cracked and falling apart. One piece of plastic, stick it on there. You will need an extra bottle of silicone. It comes with one, but you'll need two. Interior still looks brand new. Put a heated seat in there from uh, heatedseats.com. That's a great purchase, especially in the climate that I live in. Overall, I'm very, very happy with the bumper. Really set the truck off. If you're gonna redo your truck, that's probably where you gotta start. Bumper and tires and wheels. A lot cheaper than buying a new truck. Isn't that right, Coco? Coco, what do you say to that? <laughs>